Hey Tartlets, it's Deanna and I am on my way to Whole Foods to get some ingredients to make a healthy version of my grandma's cookies. She always liked to bake around the holidays, so I'm going to do that tonight. And then I'm going to see if Mark can tell that they are vegan and the healthy version of my grandma's cookies. So we'll give him a little test tonight. We're back in my kitchen and we're getting ready to bake these vegan chocolate chip cookies. And I am wearing my grandma's sweatshirt. This is her Jersey grandma's cookies. And when my grandma passed away, she left a ton of recipes and she actually left her KitchenAid mixer to me, which was like a huge honor. Um, but my grandma's cousin put together this recipe book that has all of her recipes in it, even some um, of her original recipes that have her handwriting in them. So I'm gonna show you guys her original recipe for these chocolate chip cookies and then we're gonna put our vegan twist to it. Probably won't taste as good, but we'll see. So here is my grandma's original recipe for her chocolate chip cookies. So I preheated the oven to 375 and then here are the ingredients that I'm gonna be working with. So instead of like my grandma used Crisco or like shortening oil, I'm gonna use coconut oil for a healthy alternative. Coconut milk light brown sugar, and then also unsweetened applesauce. That's going to be a key ingredient. Um, so yeah, these are just the ingredients. I will list all this down below. I hope this doesn't turn into like one of those epic fails because I don't know if it's supposed to look like this. I've just mixed all the wet ingredients together and then I'm going to mix all of the dry ingredients and then combine them together, but doesn't say it's supposed to look like this, so we'll see. So I've just mixed all the dry ingredients into my grandma's KitchenAid mixer. Now I'm going to add the wet ingredients to this and mix it on up. Hopefully, hopefully we get the result that we want. We'll see. I don't know about you guys, but my favorite part of baking cookies is eating the dough. So I'm gonna taste test the dough and see if it's similar to my grandma's cookie dough. It actually tastes very similar. Wow. I would never know that there was applesauce in this. And I would never know that this was vegan. It's really good. <laughs> Let's see if I'll be able to make any cookies or I'll eat all of this by myself. All right, first taste test. Not bad, not as good as my grandma's, but they're kind of like cakey. They taste more like a, a cake than a cookie, if that makes sense. <laughs> I'm sure I'll still eat them all, but. Hmm. Now we'll see what Mark thinks. All right, Mark is home and he is going to try one of the cookies and tell me what he thinks. All right, Mark's about to go in. The first taste of the cookie. Probably not the uh, ideal post-gym snack, but oh well. It's vegan though. How is it? Delicious. <laughs> no, not really. All right, Mark didn't <laughs> love them, on. so Jen will probably like I'll them. I'll be honest. No, they're good. Oh, good. They're a little dry. Oh. But they're good. <laughs> <laughs> they just need to be dumped in like a milk. Okay, okay. They're good. <laughs> Thanks. What did you say about the cookie? It was actually really good. I'm surprised. Are you? And I'm not really a healthy person. <laughs> I love vegan chocolate. I give it a B plus. A, just a B plus? <laughs> what? I see you going for more. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? 